The preferred method to take the 24R off the pallet is to use a forklift. If you don't have a forklift, Tormach has developed a secondary procedure using a pallet jack, 4x4, and 2x4 materials in order to lift it up and lower it nice and gently on the floor. This procedure is also described in the 24R owner's manual, and it is required that you read through it with all the warnings and cautions before proceeding. The machine is secured to the pallet with screws in the base of each foot. Remove the screws from the pallet with an 8mm wrench. Verify that the top nut on each machine foot is loose. Note, the top nut is a locking nut while the bottom nut raises and lowers the machine. Raise the machine up by about 1 inch to make room for the supports by turning the lower nut on each machine foot with a 22mm or an adjustable wrench. Put two supports on the pallet so they're approximately 6 inches from each end of the machine stand. Verify that there is enough room between the supports for the pallet jack. Stack blocks under each end of the supports. Lower the machine with a 22mm or an adjustable wrench until the weight of the machine is completely held by the supports. Verify that the feet aren't touching the pallet. Slowly remove the pallet from under the machine. Use blocks as needed under the machine frame. Lift the machine off the supports with a pallet jack. If you see the machine tipping, lower it and reposition the blocks to evenly distribute the machine's weight on the pallet jack. Once the weight of the machine is fully supported by the pallet jack, lift the machine off the supports with the pallet jack. Repeat until the weight of the machine is entirely on the floor. Now that you've successfully lowered your 24R onto the floor, head back to the 24R installation video to continue the installation process.